Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to talk about the undergraduate courses that are offered by Indian Maritime University, IMU. Okay. Now, notification for this year, that is 2020, have not yet been announced. So, I am going to give the information based on the notification that was released last year. Okay. Now, basically, this university, Indian Maritime University, it is a central university. And this university was established in the year 2008. Okay. Now, this university has four campuses, four main campuses, okay, and 18 allied campuses. Actually, there are 18 other institutes. These are private institutes and these are affiliated to IMU, Indian Maritime University. Okay. But the four campuses, or to say the five campuses, that is Chennai, uh, Kolkata, two check centers in Mumbai, and Vishakhapatnam. These are directly under IMU. Okay, the main campus of IMU is in Chennai. Now, IMU offers various courses starting from diploma courses, undergraduate courses, postgraduate courses, and PhD courses, and also MS courses. Okay, now in this video, I am going to talk about basically the undergraduate courses. That is the courses which the students who are presently in 10 plus 2 that is class 12, they can apply, okay, because notification for 2020 entrance has not yet been announced, that is because of this uh, COVID-19 problem, okay, so last year the entrance was held in June and the classes started in the month of August, okay, so first let us talk about the undergraduate courses that are available for class 12 students, okay. Now, they have this BTEC course of four years duration. One course is BTEC in Marine Engineering. Okay. And the other course is BTEC in Naval Architecture and Ocean Engineering. Okay. So, these are the two BTEC courses available. Okay. Then, for BSc, that is a three year course, BSc course, it is available in Nautical Science. Okay. Then, th now these courses are basically for only for students of science stream. Okay, now I am going to discuss the eligibility criteria in the later part of the video. Now, there are also courses which are available for other stream stu students also, like for arts and commerce stream. This, uh, the courses is BBA. Okay, BBA in, uh, this BBA in logistics, retailing and e-commerce. Now, this course is available for students of any stream. Okay, but the BSc course and the BTEC course, they, they are for only for science stream students. Okay. They also have a BSc course in shipbuilding and ship repair. Okay, this is again a three-year course. So basically, all BBA course, BSc course are three-year course, and BTEC courses are four-year courses. This is similar to any other BSc or BTEC course that are offered by other institutes. Okay, the, it also offers postgraduate courses. Okay, but uh, this video is only for the class 12 students, so I am going to discuss only about the courses that you can apply after plus two. Okay, now for all the courses except BBA in this retail management, for all the other courses, you need to appear for a test. Okay, you need to appear for a common entrance test, CET. Okay, now basically this test is a online test. Okay, and you will be getting uh, 200 questions, totally 200 questions. Okay, so what are all the topics that you need to prepare for this test? English, General Aptitude, Maths, Physics, Chemistry. Okay, so in addition to Maths, Physics, Chemistry, you also need to prepare for General Aptitude and English. Okay, now the paper level is at the plus two level. So students who have been preparing for J Main, NEET, or other such entrances, uh, they have they should not have any kind of problem. Okay, because this paper is, it will be much easier than J or NEET level. Okay, so totally there will be 200 questions. Okay, this is as per last year notification. And these online test, it is an online test and last year it was conducted all over India at around 36 centers. Okay, so totally there were 36 centers. The undergraduate courses are offered by four different schools. Okay, School of Nautical Science. School of Marine Engineering and Technology, okay, School of Naval Architecture 
and School of Maritime Management. Okay, so students who are going to study B.Sc. Nautical Science, okay, now they will be admitted under School of Nautical Science. Okay, now for B.Sc. Nautical Science, the eligibility criteria is you should have you should be definitely from science stream okay and in class 12 pcm the combined average percentage should be 60 percent or above okay and in english you must have a minimum of score of 50 percent okay now for students from scst background they will have a relaxation of five percent marks for pcm but there is no relaxation in the english marks Okay, this is for B.Sc. Nautical Science. Now, B.Sc. Nautical Science, it is offered in Chennai, Mumbai and Kochi. Okay. Now, for the four-year B.Tech course, which is offered under uh, the School of Marine Engineering. Okay. Now, this course is offered in Kolkata, Mumbai and Chennai. Okay. And the eligibility criteria is same as that of B.Sc. Nautical Science. That is, PCM 60%, English 50%. Okay, again for SCST, it is the same criteria. Okay, and this uh, School of Marine Engineering also offers a course, BSc course, that is the BSc in Shipbuilding. Okay, and eligibility criteria is same as before, that is 60% PCM and English 50%. Okay, now students who are from other streams, as I told you, other stream students can also apply for this IMU. Indian Maritime University for the course of BBA okay Bachelor of Business Administration and the specialization here is logistics retailing and e-commerce logistics retailing and e-commerce okay now for this there is no test okay so you will be admitted based on your class 12 marks but here also there is a minimum eligibility criteria that is in class 12 you must have 60 percent marks okay in any stream but 60 percent marks and english you must have 50 percent marks in english okay now with regard to the age limit there is a criteria for age limit also okay that is the minimum age at the time of admission it should be 17 years and maximum age limit is 25 years this is for all undergraduate courses okay minimum is 17 years and maximum is 25 years now, with regard to medical fitness, okay, now there are two courses in which uh, they are very much particular about medical fitness, that is B.Sc. in Nautical Science and B.Tech. in Marine Engineering, okay. So, you need to be medically fit, okay. For that, you need to download a form and it is given in their, it will be given in their website and then you need to uh, fill up that form in consultation with your uh, doctor. Okay, there are specification with regard to your eyesight also. So you need to have a proper eyesight also for these two courses, B.Sc. in Nautical Science and B.Tech. in uh, Marine Engineering. Okay, so for that you need to visit the website for that details, specific medical conditions. Okay, now as I told you, see they have four, uh, the five campuses, total five campuses, Kochi, Chennai, Kolkata, Mumbai 2 and two centers in Mumbai and Vishakhapatnam. But in addition to that, there are other affiliated institutes also, that is total 18 institutes are there, which are offering this course under IMU. Okay, so you can get the details of those institutes from the official website. Okay, I will be giving the details of their official website in the description box of this video. You can have a look into that. Okay, afterwards. Now, other one more thing is like students who have applied for improvement compartment exam or betterment exam they are also eligible to apply for this institute okay those marks will be considered provided they cross the minimum minimum eligibility criteria but there is only one condition now the condition is you must not have changed your board for your improvement marks like for example suppose you are a student from cpsc and your marks were below that 60 percent marks criteria and then uh, you appeared for your re-exam under open school or some other board and then your marks were increased those kind of situation will not be accepted okay your improvement marks must be from the same board from which you appeared for your class 12 examination
okay so these were the details with regard to indian maritime university okay if you have any additional queries you can uh, comment in the comment box i will definitely answer them okay so my best wishes